You got something to say to the people? Do you have anything to say to the people? You don't have anything to say? Did you have any breakfast? You did not have any breakfast. <clears throat> and do you just need to lay down in the sun and be left alone? Is that what you need? It looks like your head is very heavy. Is your head heavy? Maybe I could hypnotize you. Can you be hypnotized? I know it must be hard to hold up all that muscle. My heater also works good for uh, warming up your coffee. I'd like to welcome all of you to the uh, VW Nut 1967 channel on YouTube. Uh, my 67 bug, my 64 bug, this is the animal in question today. Um, a little bit more fine tuning of getting the rust out uh, of, the, um, of the front there the uh, driver's side front. I'll get the lights turned on in there and I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. just want to turn the camera on, show you my heater and my coffee warmer and say hello to everybody. And now moving forward, let's get some work done. That is a hot cup of coffee. Thank you, heater thingy. Alright, so uh, stick with me one second. I got to duck under the jungle gym. You guys are kind of looking in the right spot there. I'll hook you guys to the emergency brake uh, handle, lever if you will. Point you guys right kind of. So here's the area in question. You know this is, this metal is lackluster to say the best. Um, I don't want to take too much of it, but I definitely have to get past where it was seamed on the seam sealer. Uh, you've seen that uh, I was able to make a patch already on the other side over there. Uh, probably the same procedure will happen here. Um, I'll probably get, get my Sharpie and draw a line here and across here and then into this over here. Oh, that's pretty funky right there. So, enjoy the music. You guys should know the drill by now if you've been here long enough. Uh, if not, you'll figure it out real quick. See you in a sec. Alright, so I have to go in and check with the uh, VW Nut 1967 channel's safety officer and, and make sure that my gear is okay. Uh, hearing protection is right there, so that too was on. Um, see you in a sec. Well, we got the A okay, so excellent. Let me show you guys. Fix your foot. You guys don't, don't know that you have feet, but you have feet. Um, maybe you do know you have feet. Oh, okay, 
So here's what we're looking at now. I'm sure you guys can see it. It's, it's these two right here. I'm going to unbolt those. Yep. I'm going to start by attempting to unbolt those. We're going to try it first without spraying no stuff on it. See what happens. Watch your head on the jungle, Jim. Good thing I grew an early warning device. Okay. What do you guys think? Okay, well, you know. Nice. One. So, I pulled on that. I pulled instead of pushed. And I got a little better action. So, we'll try again. Oh, that one just doesn't. It just won't. Or doesn't want to. Or. Jeez. Oh, Oh, there we go. That's the good stuff. Nice. Oh, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe. Oh. Let's see if I can captured in the light for you guys. Just look at it, the rust. See you in a sec. Welcome. Look at you, Bond, James Bond. Look at you. Look at you, you baby gorilla. I just took them two rusty bolts out this time, sir. Instead of hacking that off with the saws, I'll there like you go. Rusty nuts and bolts out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that camera's on. Which one? That one. On the floor. Yeah. Ah, you see, you're, you're still going. Okay. You're still doing your thing. Thanks. Should be the last cut, but I'll move the light. You can move the light, and all of this is way better on this side. Like it's a hundred. It is one hundred percent on this side. One hundred. And it needs to be cleaned up. But yeah, to come back in. Yeah. yeah, you know it's way better than the other side. Yeah, good. Nice. So, okay. We make it a lot easier putting the car back together too. Oh, yeah. Takes a little longer now, but uh, this side's way gonna be way easier for me, Darren. Yeah. Way, like a million. Times. Well, plus you kind of know what to do too. You already yeah. have a. Uh, a general uh, heads up of the videos are doing good too. 
All right, so uh, we'll get you back under the car. Patina's here. I'm not sure what she's sniffosaurusing. Um, but it's the next day. No big deal. Uh, musty one came over, and uh, I had some things that I needed to take care of, so I did those. And here we are back on the project. So I'm pretty sure we left off right here in this front corner, so that's where we'll continue. Um, we're just going to make a couple of cuts and try and get that chunky heater channel out of there now that we got the bolts out of there. Um, we'll see how it goes. Enjoy the music. Here, you guys stand by. I gotta get some lights turned on. You just seen Patina was licking me in the face. Sorry about the shop music and monetization prevents me uh, from you guys hearing what I was asking her. But for my poor Pitbull puppy, it is um, dinner time and she knows it. And she knows it. So she came and licked me in the face to let me know. So that's already up front a little more. I need to massage some of that right there at my fingertip right there a little bit. And I'm going to start one final rip around for you guys. So hold on. Uh, one final rip around the pan. And uh, then I think we should be ready to start fitting this, these pieces back together. That is awesome. I can't even believe that's coming out of my mouth. Um, so, we'll get to... I will start... I'm going to start by massaging that back into shape a little bit. That's where I'm going to start. 
All right, so here's the plan. This right here probably needs to come up, but first it looks like that needs to come down. This is the that's the old rubber gasket. Let's see about tapping some of that down first. With Alright, so you guys get the idea, so that is going to do it for this one. Uh, I'd like to thank each and every one of you for hanging out with me here at the VW Net 1967 channel on YouTube and from the inside of my soon to be floored 1964 VW bug. I thank each and every one of you. We'll see you in a couple of days. Well, there's today's pile. They keep getting smaller. That must mean it's time to put some metal back into the car. So I just finished sweeping up and thought, we'll just stuff her up in there and see. And I gotta tell you that for just, we're just stuffing her right up in there real quick. I think it's gonna be a okay. Say goodbye to the people. Say, oh, you got no love for the people? Say goodbye to the people. Say goodbye to the people. Say goodbye to the people. The people say goodbye to you.